We don't prescribe opioids often in the outpatient setting, but when we do, it can be stressful. The new AAP guidelines help ease that pressure with clear, evidence-based recommendations. First, start with a multimodal approach. That means using non-pharmacologic strategies like ice, heat, massage, even acupuncture, and combining them with non-opioid medications. Opioids should only be considered when absolutely necessary. One, the pain is severe, a seven out of 10 or higher. Two, non-opioid strategies just aren't enough. And three, the source of pain is clearly identified. If you do prescribe an opioid, stick to immediate release only at the lowest effective dose and for no more than five days, unless it's related to trauma or surgery. Avoid codeine and tramadol in specific populations, which include all kids under 12, those teens 12 to 18 with obesity, obstructive sleep apnea, or severe lung disease, and anyone under 18 who's had a TNA. Be extra cautious if you're prescribing alongside other sedatives like benzodiazepines. And finally, harm reduction is essential. Offer naloxone and teach families how to respond to an overdose. Talk about safe storage and proper disposal of any remaining opioids. 